today I'm going to talk to you about resilience and what that means in helping your children gain resilience or can, um, do further tasks to, to better their resilience and what they're doing and what they want to do. So the definition of resilience is the capacity to recover quickly from difficulties. So what that might look like um, on a day-to-day -day basis is um, if they're struggling with resilience, you might see a tantrum, you might see that fight, flight or freeze mode. Um, you might see anxiety, you might see heightened emotions and really teary that you're not kind of understanding why. So if a task is too difficult for a child, we might think putting a drink bottle in the fridge is really simple and easy, but for your child that could be really, really difficult. Um, so we need to self-regulate first and get them to a point where they feel comfortable to talk to you, um, understand how they're feeling, why is that a problem, talk with them through those steps to self-regulate first. And then we need to model with them and get on the same page with your child to encourage them to be independent and find that resilience to achieve. So to model that, you might say, okay, let's do it together, I'll help you. But the child still needs to take part in that. So they might hold the drink bottle themselves. You can help with the fridge, they put it in, close the fridge. That's the first step. And then when they can achieve that, you can talk about that with them. Um, what did that feel like? You did do it by yourself. I helped you, but next time we'll do it and you can do all the steps and so forth. Um, other things you might be seeing at home could be packing up toys or in the playground, climbing on an obstacle course or putting your shoes on and getting dressed. All those things that we do day to day that we think are a very simple task may not be that simple for your child. So we learn through um, experience exposure and a willingness to try. So that's the, the basis of resilience. Um, if your children aren't experiencing these things and they don't get the opportunity to try, they're not going to gain resilience to get to the next step. And to be lifelong learners, we do need to be resilient and to try um, and to learn to succeed and to fail. Failing's okay. It's okay to get upset. Your children might cry. They might be find it really difficult we need to keep progressing um, and push them through to to achieve it and feel that sense of achievement and be able to share that with you so that when they get to the next hard thing they can be resilient and uh, work through that by themselves um, so just a few little tips if um, all your teachers here at Condi Park can help you further if you're struggling at home um, just talk to them about it and we can help you through